Hello, Bloggineers. Today we're going to unbox, or uh, since this is not a box, this is an envelope. So, unenvelope. <laughs> we're gonna unenvelope an escape room type of game, and it's called the Curious Correspondence Club. This is a monthly subscription, and I think every month you get a new chapter of the game because since this is the first month, it says chapter one. This chapter is called The Custodian's Key. And it so, says open yeah. with care. So we're going to open this envelope, it's an envelope, and we're going to play the game, then we're going to give our review. Let's open this. It says The, the Curious Correspondence Club. Let's go inside. I'm gonna just take out this thing. Okay, maybe not the whole thing. Whoa. I hope there is no spoil. Hold on, I need to take this out carefully. Oh, whoa. I hope there's no spoilers. Oh no, there shouldn't be. <laughs> Peace. And inside, oh, does this open up? Uh, I'm pretty sure it does. Okay, I'm not gonna open it right now, but it seems like this. Ow, it's sticky. I'm pretty sure that's a clue. Oh yeah, this is probably one of the puzzles or. I hope this isn't the puzzle, but I could. Whoa, it. I got it. I solved the first puzzle, which is opening it. Okay, that's chapter one, the custodian's keys. The museum's grand entrance is something to behold. A cascade of enormous stone steps spill from an oak archway. There's more to this place than meets the eye. The museum is yours to explore. Okay? That was long. Yeah, that's because it's about seven Yeah, paragraphs. but basically, we enter the lobby, and then the custodian guy named Girani <laughs> greeted us and then he vanished and now we're going to here is probably what the custodian's key was there's a letter attached to it there's a ticket over here this is probably the museum ticket to get in yeah here's the chapter one contents what's this I see you. Oh, this is where the keys go. What does this say? If you discover any of the misplaced treasures, please inform museum staff or return them to the front desk. We apologize for any inconvenience. There's a puzzle on the back. A blue sheet. What is this? Egypt, ancient wonders. This is probably a puzzle. Ooh. We have a map of the museum. Oh, wait. We have... There's two maps it's a of the puzzle. museum. It's a puzzle. Wait, how come? Oh, we... wait. Wait, there's a puzzle. There's more. Wait, no, there's more. 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 Yeah. Here. I, I picked up. I picked up. Oh. Here. Okay. Oh, I go. see. Yeah, you can assemble wait, and them Wait, where's all. the... Where, and these go on the side, I think. Oh, so yeah. On it's one big map of the museum. Here, I'll show you. Plus this problem. Whichever yeah, yeah, way yeah. it goes. Yeah, it's like a puzzle, but except it's an easy puzzle. But I don't even know if that was a puzzle. Or, well, anyways. So that was the unboxing. It looks like there's not too many. Well, it looks like there's not too many components, but these are probably all puzzles. So we have the, the six map pieces. Again, we have the key, the note on the back. We have some. This thing. We have a letter. Yeah. We have some paper with cogs and then some circles on the back and then there's a hole. That yeah, fits my finger. I ask what <laughs> cogs are. What are cogs? They're those things with bumpy things, I think. Is that a word? Yeah. Oh, then I'm very much mistaken. <laughs> okay. Ch <laughs> chapter one contents. Okay, here is basically everything we just listed. And if you need a hint, you can go to this website. That is all. We're going to play the game and come back with our review. We're back. Here's our final thoughts. 
for the Curious Correspondence Club, Chapter 1. Again, this is an escape room. So basically, the format of the game is there were six puzzles and then one final puzzle. And I must say I like the first six puzzles in the game because I think one of the best things was that um, they were all about a different topic. So there was one about Egypt, there was one about pirates, ancient Greece, the Maya, M-A-Y-A, however you say that. And was there anything else? I, um... Yeah, I think I I think we covered most of them. Okay. Yeah, there were two others. Yeah. So. What we're saying is that we like all of them. Yeah, uh-huh. And some of the puzzles were pretty cool, like the way you solved them. And overall, the puzzles were clear about what you needed to do. There are two little problems with the game that I do want to point out. One of them is the final puzzle was a little confusing and like it you had to use the keys which came from the first six puzzles. And I don't know if we did it right, but for us, some of them didn't match up. So we got the wrong codes and then we had to look at the hints. Uh, hopefully that doesn't happen to you. Maybe we just did it completely wrong, but the final puzzle was a little bit confusing. The second thing is that there are six keys, six puzzles, and then by process of elimination, when we got to the sixth puzzle, we kind of already knew the answer. Overall though, I really like this game and one of the best things was that the museum map. I thought it was cool to assemble the museum map. It was well designed. Oh, there was also good artwork in the game. And I wonder what the other chapters are like because yeah, I, I don't know if they're still in the museum. The, they probably are, right? All I know is that there is six chapters. Yeah, and I wonder if they have the same format and everything. Brother, what was your favorite part about the game? Um, well, my favorite puzzle was the pot one. I can't really say anything more. The pot one? The pot. The pot. What? Oh, yeah. The pots with the Roman numerals. No spoilers. Yeah, I know. I know. Just the one with the pot. The one the, with the pot. The pot Okay, one. that's my favorite puzzle. <laughs> If this sounds interesting to you, you can purchase it at the link in the description. And that's all. Bye. Bye bye. Go. Hello, vlogging ears. <laughs> Let's open this. Oh, wait. This one? Stop spitting, seriously. Your Dito. Your Dito pronounces the second. Reaching the archway, you step into a third stone that brings a smile to your lips. Curiositas. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs>